Hey Anushka, how are you? Thanks for agreeing to do this with us. I'm good, no problem. Welcome to West Spring Secondary School. Come on, let me take you on a tour and you can ask my friends and I any questions you want. So here we have the general office with the school's vision and mission on the wall to remind us of our purpose here in school. Your school vision is ladies and gentlemen of character and learning? Yes, because character is just as important as intelligence. Cool! So what do we have here? So here we have our Heritage Gallery, which was built in commemoration of our recently celebrated 20th anniversary. Do you want to know more? Sure! Okay, so here goes. Our most recent achievement was West Spring being chosen as one of the 28 pilot schools to embark on full SVB, which is subject-based spending, in the year 2020. West Spring was founded in the year 2000, and our first principal was Mr. Harpo Singh. You know what West Spring means? It means water from a well or spring. There are more things to know about West Spring, so if you're curious to find out more, join West Spring! Wow, that's so cool! So many achievements in such a short span of time. We are very proud of all that our seniors have achieved before us. Hopefully we can do e as well or even better. Great! So how is life at West Spring for you? Tell me more about yourself. My main CCA is the Speech and Drama Club, where we do productions such as plays, public speaking and debate. I am also in the AVA Club, where we handle the logistical and technical parts of an event. In addition, I am involved in the 18th Student Council as an Executive Committee member. Right, come on, let's head to the library now. So this is the library. Hi Matt! Hey! So this is Matthias. Hi Matthias, how are you? I'm great! Welcome to West Spring Secondary School's library. Great, thanks! So what happens here? Okay, so if you're like me, this is where I go during mother tongue lessons since I'm exempted. This is where I get to make a lot of friends with others who do not take mother tongue in school. We also get to interact and enjoy the aircon. Do you guys have all languages taken in the school curriculum? Yes, we have some languages that will be taken in school like the Malay and Chinese language. Those who take French or Tamil would have to go to other schools to take it. Oh, I think a lot of people want to know, what's the cutoff points to enter West Spring? Well. For this upcoming year, these will be the Indicative Achievement Level cutoffs for Express, Normal Academic, and Normal Technical. How many subjects do you have in Secondary 1 and 2? Alright, for Lower Secondary, you'll have a total of 12 subjects, which include English, Math, Mother Tongue, Science, FCE, DNT, Music, ALP, Geography, Literature, PE, and my personal favorite, History. Will FCE and DNT be conducted for the whole year? No. FCE and DNT are modular, so you only take the subject one semester each. Is music taught after secondary two? Music will not be conducted in West Spring Secondary School during curriculum time. However, music can be continued after Sec 2 through the O-Level Music Program. Is there an 8th subject in Secondary 3, 4, or 5? Yes, they will be for people who are capable and decide to choose it. Alternatively, you can opt to take 7 subjects. When will the 8th subject be conducted? The 8th subject will be accommodated for during normal school curricular time. Could you tell me more about ALP? Applied Learning Program? Sure. Our ALP is about developing critical thinking and creative skills in students, making them into a media literate. ALP is beneficial as students learn more about their surroundings. They learn to be critical receivers of information and share their ideas and thoughts through infographics, videos, blogs, posters, and even podcasts. Come, and I'll take you to Oosh. This is our After School Engagement Center, aka the Oosh, which stands for Our Own Special Home. A place for students to go to after school, where there are activities for them to participate in. Let's check it out! Hi, Ilhan. Hello, welcome to Oosh. You can ask me anything about co-curricular activities. Okay, so what is your CCA? I'm in football, which happens to be my favourite sport. Oh, what team do you support? Chelsea! Okay, great team this year. Expensive. Let's see where they end up at the end of the season. So how does your CCA benefit you? After joining the CCA, it taught me the importance of teamwork and resilience. Plus, I got the opportunity to expand my social circle and extend my leadership qualities. So, 
What awards have you achieved in your CCA? In my years of West Spring, we managed to clinch the Merit Award, which was the top 6 in schools in the National School Games. Is it hard to get accepted into the CCA? No. As long as you are willing to come in and work hard in the CCA, you will be able to join it. Do you think West Spring focuses on both academics and non-academics areas of students? Yes, actually. What has West Spring done to contribute to the non-academic areas of students? West Spring implemented other activities such as camps and VIAs. From this, students will be able to learn new values and engage in new experiences which are not attainable from the classroom. Does West Spring offer extra activities for CCAs? Yes, for instance, during the school holidays, the school offered football CCA multiple gym sessions. Ooh, your CCA must be so privileged. So, Yuhan, how do you get into West Spring? I got into West Spring through DSA. It is tough, but it helped me reserve a conventional spot in West Spring. Can I bring you to the shooting range now? Now, we have arrived at our shooting range, and here is Juan. Hi. Hello, Juan. Hi. So aside from cool CCAs, what other opportunities do students have to demonstrate their leadership here? Well, you can join the student council. How do you get in? You can send in your applications and get the teachers to second them. You will then be interviewed by the exco and school leaders. So how do you come to school every day? I take the bus. There are direct buses such as 920, 972 and 976 around the Bukit Panjang area. They can also be found at the Bukit Panjang interchange at Hillion Mall if you are travelling from a further distance. What kinds of activities can I look forward to at West Spring? We have after-school activities, post-exam activities and even camps. Let my friend Jenlin tell you more. Hi Jenlin! Hi! Welcome to West Spring! Thank you! Wang was just talking about post-exam activities. What are the post-exam activities offered by West Spring? Well, sometimes we go out and do learning journeys and do outdoor activities like outdoor cooking and archery. We even learn to make and fly kites. Do you get to go on excursions? Sometimes West Spring participates in various competitions with other schools like sports, visual, or even the performing arts. And we also have learning journeys to different parts of Singapore to learn more about her culture and her history. Do you get to travel overseas? Um, sadly, this year all our trips got cancelled due to COVID-19. Otherwise, we would have gotten to travel as a class in Secondary 3, where we do OVIA. Our mother tongue department also takes us overseas to places like Taiwan or Malaysia. Moreover, the school band gets to travel to Kedah for an exchange program. How lucky! Students get an opportunity to participate in Project Touching Hearts, which helps a community in Cambodia as well. Yeah, COVID spoils everything, but wow! Interesting. Then, what sort of sports do you do during PE classes? Uh, we do lots of stuff like badminton, volleyball, ultimate frisbee, blah blah blah. Sport for choice. Do you have sports day? Yes, we do. What kind of things do you do then? Sports. Is West Spring Secondary School connected to West Spring Primary School? No, it is not. Is West Spring a good school? All schools are good schools. What type of food is provided in the school canteen? There are many varieties of food in the canteen, ranging from Chinese, Malay, Indian, and even Western cuisine. Is the food in West Spring affordable? It is as affordable as the next school, I guess. So right now, I'm going to take you to the ISH. So this is my friend, Chan Han. Hi! Hey Chan Han, what do you think is the most popular CCA in West Spring? It has to be festive drums. It is my CCA and I find it a therapeutic way to release my energies and frustrations after a long week at school. What are some CCAs that are not commonly found in other schools? Over here in West Spring, we have shooting, display band, festive drums, and kuchum. Okay, I have an important question to ask. Can you bring your mobile phone to school? You cannot use your phone during curriculum hours or during lessons, unless the teachers allow it for the lesson. However, you can use it during recess in a foyer or canteen. You can definitely bring your phone to school though. Great news! What is the reporting time? You will have to report to school by 8.20am on Mondays and at 7.20am from Tuesday to Fridays. And we usually end by 2.40pm except on Fridays where we end at 12.20pm. 
Would you be allowed to wear PE attire to school? We are not allowed to wear PE attire to school, as we are supposed to be ladies and gentlemen. What is the uniform like? The uniform are white with collar, and the pants for the gentlemen are dark blue, whereas the skirts for the ladies are purple. Why is it dark blue for boys and purple for girls? Why not? What is your favourite thing about West Spring so far? The favourite thing I have in West Spring so far are the friends that I have met. They are very kind and caring. We are also a very close-knit school community. Come, let's go! Hey Anushka, I'm here to return them to you. Thank you! So did you enjoy the tour? Definitely! Learned lots of things. Glad to hear. Is there anything else you would like to know? Yeah! Why should I join West Spring? Well, because West Spring strives to provide an engaging academic program and a strong character and leadership development focus in students. Great answer! I think that's it. Thank you so much, guys.